big news coming in from the Supreme Court. It is breaking news. Finally, we have an intervention. The Supreme Court has decided to intervene in the Unnao rape case. Uh, what has the Supreme Court said? Well, the Supreme Court has first demanded that the CBI send a responsible officer to actually give them the latest information in terms of the investigation, give them details of what it looks like prima facie right now, what happened in the accident that happened on Sunday uh, that has left that rape survivor in hospital still critical, including the lawyer, including her lawyer, who's also critical. That is the first part. The CBI said, well, can you give us time? And can we uh, have a hearing at 10.30 a.m. tomorrow? Uh, the Chief Justice of India said, nothing doing. We want to hear it at noon. Send a... Uh, a, a person from uh, the CBI, a CBI officer to give us the latest and if it is a situation where the information is too sensitive at a time when the investigation is still ongoing, well, we can hear it indoors and it doesn't have to be in open court. Uh, that is also what has been said by the Supreme Court. In addition to that, the Supreme Court has said that they will be transferring, they will be transferring four of these cases. The Unnao cases are divided into four cases. They will be transferring them from UP to Delhi and that is a huge embarrassment from the, for the Uttar Pradesh government, the police, the establishment in general. Let's go straight across, if we can, to my colleague Sukirti for more on this. Sukirti, uh, can you hear me? Yes, I'm told okay. I can hear you. So, Sukirti, uh, take us through one by one. Uh, let's start with the four cases being transferred. Uh, they will be transferred. They've not yet been transferred. What did the Supreme Court say when it decided to uh, say that they're going to be transferring these Unnao cases from UP to Delhi? Well, so firstly, uh, the Supreme Court has asked the CBI officials to turn up before the Supreme Court and inform them, inform the Supreme Court about the status of all the cases. So there are four cases in total, as we mentioned. There's a rape case, a kidnapping case, a gang rape case, and the fourth case, uh, which is about the murder of the father of the victim. So these four cases that had been pending before the CBI court in Lucknow, uh, the Supreme Court has said that they should be transferred to Delhi. And he has also asked for the status of uh, the fifth case, which is uh, the case that has that is now being handled by the CBI, which is with regard to the accident that took place on 28th of July, uh, when the car in which uh, the victim was traveling along with her uh, family members and the lawyer, uh, that uh, got into a car accident. Family so, members and the lawyer, uh, that uh, got into a car accident. So there are these five cases now, four of which already pending in the Lucknow CBI court, and now those four will be transferred to Delhi. Uh, this also, I mean, uh, definitely reflects on the UP government badly because uh, they it had been uh, these cases were being uh, looked at in Lucknow. The victim's mother had actually sent uh, gave, filed a petition three months ago in the Supreme Court on 16th of April, saying that the cases, all the four cases, should be transferred from Lucknow to Delhi because as long as they are dealt with in Lucknow, uh, Kuldeep Singh Sanger, since he happens to be an MLA. Uh, in now he can uh, influence those cases. He's a powerful, a powerful man. He has several associates who could try to influence the case, and then justice will not be met with. So uh, even then, when 16th April the case came up, the Supreme Court had said that notices should be sent to CBI as well as Kuldeep Sanger, the accused, and the other accused in the case. Uh, the notices were sent by the Supreme Court Registry two months after this particular hearing on 16th April took place. However, uh, the responses have not yet been filed by the CBI or from Kuldeep Sagar in this regard with regard to the transfer of the cases. So those responses had not even come yet. But uh, this appeal by the mother that was yet, uh, earlier made to transfer the cases, now that is something the Supreme Court has agreed to. All the four cases set to be transferred to uh, from Lucknow to Delhi.